for me, this is this is it's okay. I think we've got to be careful with this though. This is my caveat, and this is what came to mind. I think you can speak affirmations. Um, yes, but you can delude yourself too. Hundred percent. You've got to be careful. That's a good. That's because a really good thought. You can speak yeah. it. <laughs> you can speak it, but you've got to follow through with actions to to, to do that. I mean, you know. Muhammad Ali did not like to say I'm the greatest and just did sat back on his sofa and go, I am the greatest, I am the greatest, I am the greatest. And this is one of the things that I'm very, very passionate about because there's a book called The Secret. I read it and it says, all you got to do is think and imagine you're doing this thing and da 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 da. But there's a massive piece missing from it. You've got to actually do some work. You've got to put in the work. Like, but I think what you're saying, Lee, what I really liked about this was what you're saying is you speak the affirmation, but what you do is you then it encourages you to do the actions that are necessary for that to become a reality right it's the it's the work but it's the work when people aren't looking it's the work when people aren't watching it's where muhammad ali or cassius clay as you would formerly known and ryan you're the sports guru here so please correct me if i'm wrong you know putting in the work putting in the training and he trained super hard i mean crazily hard um to get to where he wanted to be so it doesn't just come about by of course, you had some natural talent as well, but you know you still got to harness that natural talent. Just because you're you've got a got a, almost like a gift for boxing doesn't necessarily going to be the best because you still have to harness that gift. And he did by working super hard, putting himself out there. Like you talked about, I've been editing that that episode by the way. Putting yourself out, there. I really love that episode by the way. You two, you two did it in your own. I loved it. By putting yourself out there, taking risks, and really putting yourself on the line, which you do in boxing, you've got to be prepared. You've got to be fit. You've got to be prepared to take the hits. So I'd just be a caveat around that, that yes, you can speak affirmations, but you've got to have a plan to start to make that a reality. And that means having a small action steps. It could be that, you know, if you want to be the greatest at something, then you've got to t start taking a few steps, right? And I think, Ryan, you mentioned this before, actually, that, you know, there can only be a certain amount of percentage that can be the greatest at something, right? But it doesn't mean you don't, you can't, you, you can't try, but there is a very small percentage of, there's that whole against the, the win type thing where you're pushing against things. But that's how great people win because the, the, the odds are stacked against them. And uh, yeah, I just love that quote. Um, I am the greatest, but you've got to back that up, haven't you? Um, and he backed it up for sure. Yeah, that's my view anyway. Uh -huh.